SP Maths 10 comes with a brand new user interface with enhanced modeling and reporting features. We have also added a templates module to facilitate quick and easy creation of foundation models. All the required modeling tools have been made available in the ribbon. Date and modeling, SP Maths features structural grids. Grids in both X and Y directions can be quickly generated using the generate command. Slabs of different shapes can be drawn by using the slab tool. Dimensions and coordinates can either be entered graphically or by using the dynamic input box. Errors, if any, can easily be rectified using the undo and redo commands. Select a slab and modify its properties in the left panel. Selecting also allows editing the item geometry by using various tools in the left panel toolbar. Columns and piles can easily be defined, assigned, modified and deleted. Views can easily be changed using view controls, improving model visualization. Assigning and editing of loads have also been simplified. They can be assigned one at a time or in groups. Assigned loads can easily be selected and edited in the left panel. It is also possible to use multiple viewports both during modeling and investigation phases. Display tab allows toggling on and off and adjusting the sizes of various model elements. Any created models can be easily rendered in 3D to get a feel of the actual structure. After completing the model, user can use the Solve tab to optimize mesh criteria and modify various solver options. SP Maths generates enhanced contours as solution results. Values at any point in the contour can be obtained by simply moving the cursor to that point. The left panel can be used to navigate between various contours. Deformed shape with different scale factors is available to understand the foundation behavior. The reporter module can be used for viewing, customizing and printing or exporting the reports in various formats. Thank you for watching. Please visit StructurePoint.org for more information.